well, having been in golf in the past 20 years, um, I knew a lot about the playing side and that the event side, I suppose. Um, and I just felt that with that, I don't actually end up having any kind of qualification. But by joining the PGA, um, after three years, I will have a qualification and I'll, I'll learn more about everything in golf, down from sales to retail to um, club fitting, coaching, uh, sports science. I think the, de the depth of knowledge is, you know, is fantastic really. Yeah. The, the depth you go into in assignments is, is great and probably things we're doing that I didn't really appreciate happened. You know, I, obviously I've, I've dealt with psychologists and so on. And, but it just, you know, really an eye opener, which is great. I think there's more diversity than people realise. You don't just have to be a teaching pro that works at a golf club. You can go into being a golf sales rep. You can be a general manager, a director of golf. All these sorts of things that people don't necessarily realise until you start taking the course. I love coaching. I love working with people. Uh, that's, so that's pretty much what, why I'm doing this. Really, is to become a, a very good golf coach, whilst keeping my my playing side of things keep my hat in the ring there not like taking it as serious as i used to but still a little bit of practice here a little bit of practice there and entering as many tournaments as i can so i'd like to see myself you know maybe one or two days working at some melee and then maybe five days self-employed where i can do a mixture of a lot of coaching and, and quite a bit of playing as well when i was a young when i was a youngster a junior golfer i uh, i was coached by pga pros and trainees and you know spending time at the golf club you got to know them and got to know about the course a little bit but from, from when I was, you know, of that age, probably 15, 16 to now, the programme seems a lot more in-depth and, you know, covers a, a greater scope. I've always enjoyed playing, that's the reason I started it. Um, like I say, you can play as much or as little as you want to. Unfortunately, I haven't had that much chance to play this year, but there's, I mean, during the summer there's events every week, so it's good that there's so much for you to play in because you have your county regions, like you say, your south region, your national region. And tournaments like this, where there's guys from all over the country, the top guys for the year, competing against each other, three-day event, it's, yeah, it's good fun. Five years, I'd love, I'd love a couple of things. Obviously, we talked to all the boys here. We obviously all love to be playing on the European tour. But you know, I, I'm 28 now, so at the end of the day, I, I want to be settled when it comes to that kind of stage. And um, I'd be more than delighted to be a PJ professional at, a, at, a, at an establishment in, in Ireland, hopefully in Dublin, which would be handy. Um, I don't necessarily want to move too far abroad, but, um, but that's how I see it panning out, to be perfectly honest. That's how I'd like to, how I'd like to play it out the next few years, is get my qualification and, uh, and then move on into a, into a head pro, establish, uh, head pro uh, position and um, please God, I would be successful.